what your iPhone lock screen says about you as a person. Mm -hmm. And this one Australian bloke has been embarrassed internationally by how lame his lock screen is. Imagine being international news about how lame your lock screen is. But first, if you have a selfie, a picture of your pet, picture of your partner, picture of your baby, or the default Apple one, this is what it says about you. What Ooh. have you got, Tony? Um, I have like a um a beautiful photo of the ocean. Ooh. Um, because I used to have a picture of um, my partner Torbs, mm. and then I found that like when I was out in public, I was like, oh, that's actually private. Oh, okay. And so I would be using my phone, and I'd be like, oh, and so I just set it as something that would like. The idea, and I don't know if there's any signs on this, but the idea is that when I look at that, it feels like fresh and new, right? Like it doesn't... If your iPhone lock screen is the picture of nature... <gasps> Mine is, yep. It means you have inspirations to travel and seeing the world and you feel somewhat, not necessarily trapped, but you feel like you haven't seen everything you want to see and you haven't done everything you want to do. And this is a little reminder that there's more out there for you. Genuinely, that's why I picked this. Because I was like, it reminds me of like the rest of the world. When I'm going for The science work, is real. This is like a horoscope. It, really, it kind of is. This is cool. Cam, I like what, this. What have you got on yours, Cam? Uh, mine's an amalgamations of things that I love. So it's a little Photoshop picture oh, a collage. of a meerkat, um, mountains with snow, the docking station from Interstellar, Lavender, <laughs> the logo from Watchmen, and the eye from Everything Everywhere all at once. I feel like that's a similar collage. in terms of a reminder of the world around us and everything yeah, out there. I think so. Um, What's yours? I've got a picture of Bridget. Um, now, well, that seems obviously quite lame, but she's wearing a dressing gown and hugging a cheeseburger. A cheeseburger. Oh. And I just remi- it's just like the cutest thing ever. Yeah. If your iPhone lock screen is a picture of your partner, it indicates the closeness of your relationship Mm -hmm. and you love it when someone asks about the photo because it means you get to gush about the person you adore the most. So someone goes, oh, what's that? And I go, oh, it's Bridget. She's hugging a cheeseburger and it's so cute. Oh, that's really nice. Um, Can I tell you what Torbs' lock screen is? Please. Um, So it's a picture of my face um, smooshed up against the shower screen door um, and it looks like I'm trapped in the phone. <laughs> <laughs> so it looks like I'm trying to give him a little kiss through the phone. One day you will be trapped in a phone and it'll be like the boy who cried wolf. Yep, and no one will believe him because <laughs> yeah. I'll be like, oh, I heard that on the podcast. Yeah, I've that seen was, that photo. Yeah. It was funny. We get it. Yeah. Right. Go, oh, but I'm really, I'm really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, you know what that means though? What? Torbs respects the closeness of your relationship and Torbs loves it when he goes to work and people go, oh, what's that? Because he gets to gush about the person he adores yeah. and he gets to say, oh, my my partner's so funny and quirky. You Look. almost said wife. I know. I know. I felt that. <laughs> I didn't know if you picked that. No, I almost said wife. <laughs> if your iPhone lock screen is a picture of your pet. Yep. Um, which is surprising that we don't have that. I feel like we've both got pet on the phone energies. Pet on the phone and, energy. <laughs> um, it means you're an emotional person who feels a lot of feelings. Also relatable. That is relatable. Uh, Since your pet can put a smile on your face no matter what you're dealing with, you love to have their smiling mug on your phone to bring your emotions back when need be. So if you're having a rough time, I can just like, you know. Um, Pippa is the lock screen on my laptop. That counts. Like the, um, like, you know, when you log in and it's got the circle with a photo in it, that's a picture of Pippa like this. That's really cute. And that's so when my I open my laptop, that's the first thing that I see. And I'm like, oh, my baby. Now, I don't want to say I read this article on like Wish or what's that one? The red. like when you Cora. Give, oh, Cora. Yeah. Like and the question. Yeah. Is Cora always like? I think it's like, like a it's question. Like, it's like Yahoo Answers, isn't it? Yeah. I mean. Reddit. Was that what you were going to say? The thing that starts with R? No, it was Cura. Oh. Cura. Yeah. Cura. <laughs> 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 um, this is Someone m- just dropped, dripped, chopped. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, mate. Sorry. Uh, Tony's about to give me shit about being able to talk. No, you go. No, you go. <laughs> Someone just booked a trip to New Zealand, but <laughs> obviously then I just c- c- fucking stopped talking. I did just book a trip to New Zealand. Yeah. Um, <laughs> this is where whoever wrote it at whatever company or whatever website starts getting a bit sassy, Ooh. which I actually didn't mind. If your iPhone lock screen is a selfie, you're probably very confident in yourself, or at least you're trying to seem like it. 
Oh, oh, okay, <laughs> don't at me, please. Um, if your iPhone lock screen is a picture of you with your friends, it means you're not necessarily a social butterfly, but around your best friends, you never have to hide your true self. Oh. Seeing this picture reminds you to be your best true self like you can be when your friends are around. Oh, that's really nice. It really is. I watched this TikTok um, like this morning or mm-hmm. yesterday, and it said, um, and it was this girl, and it was a, like a very one of those very aesthetic videos. She's like tidying her apartment, and the um, caption thing was like, "Oh, I always thought that I was an introvert because I don't like being around a lot of people, mm. but it turns out I just like being at peace." So it's not about um, being an introvert. It's like, oh, I'm extroverted around people that make me feel comfortable and calm yep. and who I enjoy rather than it being like, oh, I don't like people. Yeah. It's I, like, no, I just i am specific about who I put energy to, into. Do you think it's like I thought I was an introvert, but it actually just turns out I fucking hate my friendship group? Friends, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and, like, like, your friends don't bring you joy and, yeah. like, you've maybe got, like, a bit of a toxic friendship group or there's someone that always puts you on edge or whatever. Mm. So then you think you don't like going out, but in reality it's that you don't like going out with them. Yeah. Don't. And I, that really, like, threw me because I was like, fuck, I've definitely experienced times where I'm like, I hate going out. It's like, no, I just don't have anyone that I want to go out with, you know? Back in the past, Can we, like uh, in no, like man. not currently, because I'd love to. Do you, let's go out tonight, the three of us. Great for dinner. Sure, great. My shout dinner oh, on me. Yeah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, right. Yeah, all right. I was about to say, how am I going to cancel this one? But if you're yeah, paying, no, let's go out for dinner tonight. Okay. My shout, great. So this one bro, uh, his lock screen is a screenshot from his notes. And it's obviously like oh. a bit of a reminder. To like, he's left himself a bit of a note to like keep grinding and keep hustling. Oh, and like, that's really sweet. It's actually, actually. fucking not. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry. It's so lame. He lost oh, it. I think that's really. Wait nice. till I read the things. Okay, sorry. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> Fuck <laughs> bitches, get money. And I'm like, oh. Yo, you, you've seen the article. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Let me read them out. You're joking me. Number one, get jacked. Um, have $25,000 in bank account. Have three girls on roster at all times. <gasps> no. Get better at fighting. <laughs> what? <laughs> Get better at fighting. Have a motorbike. Cool. Don't get a haircut for three months. <laughs> He's grounded out. Working on himself. And so this guy's lost his phone and oh. it's been handed in. See, I thought that was sweet until he got to the bit yeah, about no, we having, heard. having three girls on the roster. That's not ideal. No. Is it at the end of the day the the iPhone box is empty except for that one because even he didn't want to go up and go yeah so the one about fucking bitches <laughs> and getting money that one's mine. <laughs> he goes yeah what's on the lo- what's on your lock screen? He goes I'll just buy a fucking yeah. Nokia. <laughs> like he had that twenty five grand in his in his account. He bought a new iPhone. <laughs>